Oh God, that's so horrible. Who is that? That's Taylor Swift. God damn! You remember when she used to be talented? Like more real. Probably can't get a shot of it from thirty window. Fake moon or real? Let's try it without the smart auto on. Looks like somebody drew a face on it, don't it? Two big black eyes, a little nose, and a sideways grimace of a mouth. Anybody else seeing that?
Thank you. 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 Thank on the planet, they wouldn't be homeless. Well, it's better. It's Saturday night. Saturday night. There's hardly anyone at the bar. All the parking lot's a little more full. Maybe people are at home eating. Die earlier. It's starting to look more normal around here now. slam on your brakes and throw people in the dashboard and shit. And then when I pull right out in front of you, I'm just gonna like go really slow. I, I don't know what it was. It was the, the Taco Bell fucked me up that bad or what, but god damn it. Just can't drive now. What the hell it is the over there? corridor as one of Traverse City's major corridors. Since then, the city began a charrette process where the public had a say in the vision and design of the remodel. This process is where the new concept design comes from, which includes a three-lane road with planters and off-street bike tracks. We have been focusing more on the street uh, than anything. And when I say the street, more on the uh, traffic circulation yeah, of uh, the bicyclists, pedestrians. Probably blew out of somebody's garbage. Vehicles. And so how they interface, how they come into intersections. Look at this double standard. This fucker here, they were told a month ago about this guy. Well, everything could be sabotaged coming at the Trump administration, so they they want to properly vet things. And because he didn't jump and just fire somebody over some rumors, this little fucktard propagandist is putting her through the ringer. It's like, come on, let's show the fucktard again. I can't recall. It's like, this has just been drawn out so long, I decided to go get the camera and show it. Because, hey, I'm going to make a video out of this. It's bullshit. Yeah, a month ago, they were told. It took them a month to figure it out. Fucky boy. Yeah, you're just going to go jump and fire somebody like that because somebody said some rumors? Somebody from the propagandist media? The media hasn't told the truth yet. Look how they're trying to twist this. Oh, my God. There he is. Propaganda boy. He took them glasses off and want to poke into his face so bad. The key here, and I want to repeat it, the key here is the misleading of the vice president and others. The incomplete information or the inability to completely recall what did or did not happen. As and the constant assaults against the Trump administration. So anything that anybody from the media says could be a lie. Yeah. Let's put, let's put that way where it belongs. Right there on you, buddy. Liars. Do we ever, ever see any of these fuckers tell the truth? I should have kept filming so I could have filmed with this little fucktard propagandist who can't tell what you said. Yep, they're all bought by Soros, ain't they? Uh-huh. See the Orwell story? They're finally going to report on now that they're done reporting on Beyonce and Lady Gaga and the Super Bowl. And uh, it's like they knew about this in 2005. They're crying about Trump not firing somebody because a propagandist told them some shit. And here they got from scientists in 2005. That's two administrations that let this shit get to this point. Uh-huh. And Trump's bad for not firing somebody based on rumors until he vets them and makes sure that it's not rumors, huh? Whoa. 